Just because your boy stay late to the party doesn't mean he doesn't show up to the party at all. I bagged up a fragrance that has been talked about in Fragcom. I've seen pictures of this little fucking bear absolutely everywhere. So I figured I'm not gonna buy it until I could get a dope deal or at least a coupon. So let's roll my motherfucking music and talk about Moschino Toy Boy. Bless you, morning, my beautiful peoples. You know who it is. This is your boy, c 3 u 3 b 3 a Trying to keep it quick, short, to the point. First impressions is real first impressions. I don't know what the dry down is gonna be like. I don't know what the opening gonna be like. I don't know what the performance is gonna be like. I'm gonna let you know if I like this shit first impressions or if I don't, if I think this shit is worth the hype or this shit is trashola.com. Clearly, this shit ain't even opening. This is some fresh out the box shit, so. So open this shit up right now. Dun, dun, dun. More mess for wifey to clean up. You know how we do. Mary's filled with cash. I win the fashion district. So never did I think that I would buy a bottle that legit looks like a fucking toy teddy bear. But then again, dudes be buying them Rocha's bottles that look like ass plugs. So fuck it. Why not, right? So I'm gonna spray this shit on a test strip and then I'm gonna spray it on my skin and I'm gonna let you know what I think of this joint. One second. All right, let's go. Let's see what's up. Bang, bang, put the cap back on so y'all motherfuckers can see the teddy bear. Oh, it's nice. I don't know why I expected something different. Oh, I just swallowed like half of it, pause. It's nice, I gotta put this shit on skin. Damn, on papers, it's kind of whack. Barely smells shit. All right, am I losing my sense of smell? Do I got COVID? That's all I need in my life. All right, let's go. Now, real talk on paper, it didn't smell like much. I mean, it was really faint on paper. I thought I had COVID for a second. But on skin, I don't know if it's the sillage or I don't know what my skin is doing with it, but it's not like popping off my skin like crazy. It's just kind of subdued and really subtle. Not to question its performance, because I don't know, but it doesn't just blast off my skin like I would hope. But it is definitely fruity, sweet, not feminine. It's got a nice unisex quality. It's got a little bit of a peppery vibe, definitely some bergamot in there. There's some ambery nuances to this shit. It's got a little bit of a leather vibe, but it's kind of got like a sweet, fresh, peppery kind of sensation. It has a little bit of like a candied, like a Jolly Rancher kind of vibe, some candy sweetness. Not a gourmand, because the citrus is definitely overpowering. It smells like a hybrid of a Jolly Rancher, like if you took red and green Jolly Rancher together and kind of did something with it. But it's also got a little bit of a darkness. Maybe it's a suede kind of material or leather. It's a nice fragrance. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. For first impressions, I think it's pretty decent. I'm curious to know what the performance is like. I ain't gonna lie because on my skin, it doesn't smell like a powerhouse like at all. It smells kind of faint and kind of subdued. Like I kind of got to dig in it a little bit just to smell these notes. Let me try on clothes. Fuck it, I mean, might as well. Like I'm not getting much power out of this shit. I don't know if it's me, man, if I'm suffering from... <sighs> Nah, I could still sniff. Yeah, I'm getting a sweet Jolly Rancher-ish, ambery, bergamot, citrusy, fresh, peppery, woody, kind of like every fucking nose note that you can think of. But it has a little bit of kind of maybe a, a, a complexity about it. For the fact that I gotta dig in and kind of look for shit, it feels like it has a little bit more about it than I know. I don't know what the notes are on this shit. Usually I don't know notes, I don't know anything, but I do know, I do like it. I really do like it. I just don't know what the performance is like. And based on this first impressions, I don't know if it's kind of mm, iffy. Personally, I think right from jump, not to make this a super complicated video, I think this is a nice fragrance. I don't know if the performance is gonna be too great. It could be my skin, it could be my nose, my DBA, who knows? Personally, again, I get more of like a hybrid combination of Jolly Ranchers with a citrus opening some kind of leathery suede base with woods and maybe a little bit of a pepper vibe I think it's a nice fragrance I still think it's a little bit pricey for what it is nowadays yeah I didn't pay retail nor was I going to pay retail I believe the general consensus hype around this shit is that it was good and it is good I just don't know performance wise it has me a little shaky so is this a ball sprayer I'm actually undetermined yet if it's a ball sprayer I do like the fragrance but just the performance factor has me a little iffy I'm gonna give it a solid half a ball spray right now based on my outfit look I want to know what the performance is like so excuse me like I really gotta waft this shit up from my ball bag to my face to try to get something and I'm not getting much so I'm a little you know disappointed on that aspect but what y'all motherfuckers think of toy boy that shit sounds like a mysterious ad on a weird section in Craigslist I'll see y'all bitches next time you know what is this the biggest in the game doing first impressions and spending money fuck my life smooches Fresh, who is best? One of those
Tell him. Pass the test. Tell him. Who I am. For the fly gun holder, money folder, motor roller, star tag. When it's time to call back. Oh. For the rough, rugged, and raw way. This nigga Jay, it's a game, but he don't play. Hey. For all the chicks that got dead in the penthouse suite on top of my mom's crib. Hey. It's long since you never get in. It's long since that you would think that you.